All right, this is the second part of our video. I don't know if it will be a third part, but now we have to set up our lights because if you render it now, you will see that over bright, okay? So let's start hiding our lights here. Let's hide, let's choose view uh, hidden geometry and let's set this light to something very low something about two let's mm, let's say okay and render to see what is what does this do does this do? Mm, let me see to other angle. We have to see what is happening here. We can see our light. We can see a little light here and a little cast shadow. Okay, let's hide it. Now let's select the secondary light I don't know if secondary exists in English but you know what I mean let's unhide it and let's add it and say something about two it will be a little more strong than that because of the size the size of our light change the strength okay more bigger more strength we have here that's fine I think that's okay let's hide it let's unhide our first light and let's say three let's see what is what does this do Let's render. I think that's good. I think we can even. No, no, let me see. Let's choose our scene one. Let's render to see how this is getting. Okay, that's really nice. I think I'm going to just rotate a little bit and update my scene and render again again alright that's fine now we have to deal with our material so I'm going to just select our glass and choose any color you want to because it don't matter the color because the glass is totally transparent so you choose a ref reflect layer let's call it glass let's rename it to glass rename he don't want to be renamed so I don't care either let's change it to something about two okay both on First now your I O R and refract and set the highlight glossness to something about point nine to give us some glossness some shine here okay and we have to make it totally transparent okay and we have to add some refractions our IOR index of refraction for glass is something about um, I don't know I have no idea let's try something about that okay 1.5174 mm. and let's check effect health and effect la uh, shadows to uh, see light go through our glass okay 
that's okay and let's make a quick, quick render here I will increase our output size let me say something about 800 and render we're getting some really nice results here but as you can see we, we, we got those little things and there's one reason to them that's why that's they are there because we have face upon other face upon I don't know if that that is the word I only know that if you have one face and other face let's group it make group and stay put one into another you get those glitches and because they don't know what to show this face or this face so it stayed like that that's why we have that result here with those things um, the most common error is that the guy say okay let's fix it and just use our scale and scale it a little bit in okay that's fine but it will produce a non-realistic render it don't matter what kind of engine render you are using always will look fake because you you got you you get this result and that's not good okay it seems the the water is not touching the surface of glass you have two ways to make it work okay first you have to scale it up so to this coming in our glass a little bit so you get the same result we have first okay S without those uh, glitches and, and artifacts and you have the second way that is to make something like that just do uh, uh, a little board in our water surface just like that and then make our glass with follow me tool and before you smooth that you have to delete some some faces I'm sorry let's make it again and before you smooth that shape you have to select all those uh, all 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 that and delete okay oh I'm sorry you have to group it let's group and then select those faces and delete right let's select the edges either and delete and then you ha you can make the smooth you can smooth and group it make group and make your water shape okay so the water it will be just on the surface of our interior glass but it won't be the z fighting you we have seen face in other face okay and so that's the way i did this glass here this glass here with this liquid okay i've done just like i've i have already shown you okay select our circle here and then smooth it 
and reverse the faces. Right, I don't have any more time. I hope you like it. Okay.